Hey everybody, this is uh, Jay Halbert with uh, Howard Outdoors and um, after a long uh, five day wait, um, four or five day wait, we are uh, finally back here at the, um, at the land and I'm getting kind of worried because right now I'm seeing a whole lot of um, coyote tracks. There. We kind of small though. Well, well, in front of it is small though. Uh, I'm not real for sure. I'm getting kind of worried um, about my population and stuff with the coyotes. I might have to set out, buy a few traps and set them out. See the, uh, whenever the trapping season comes in, I ain't never trapped before, but my my buddy from West Virginia has, and he he's taught me everything that he he's knew about uh, trapping and stuff. So I might uh, I might um, buy me a trap to set it out here for the uh, coyotes. Where we are uh, past the ditch right now, and uh, with these high weeds and stuff. Just being extra cautious because it is summertime and well, snakes are out. It's warm, the snakes are out, and I hate snakes with a passion. Looks like our friends have been digging. Look at that. And you can tell by the mud and stuff, it's a good thing that it rained. We needed the rain. We needed the rain a whole lot bad. Um, you can tell the deer has been in there. I mean, cause look at the tracks. And uh, look at over here. Bunch of other tracks. Right in here is where most of the deer come. A lot of them walk down that pond hill right there. Um, they walk on that road behind the point right there. They walk down that road. They walk. They walk. There's a row behind there, they walk down that road, and then the, sometimes they'll come from that road right here. And um, either way, they'll give me a good shot at a, uh, at a deer, which my bow, uh, my bow stand is right there, my deer stand is right there. So uh, hopefully we'll have some good luck this year. It's a looking real, real good. I am getting super excited about this bow season. Oh my gosh, look at here, man. Look at all the scrapes. I mean, scraping for corn, man. Scraping, I mean. I might I wanna have to buy a new, uh, bag of corn because I think this one is just about out. Hold on just a second. Look at there. Well, right there. Look. Like I said, corn don't last long in a uh, five gallon bucket. Well, 50, five gallon, 50 pound bucket. 50 pound of corn. I put it in. Eh, it, lasts, it lasted pretty good. I la it lasted for about a week and a half, I guess. Well, today is, um, It is today. Today's Saturday. I put it in. I'm trying to think of whenever I put it in. <laughs> Thinking I put it in Friday. Probably Friday. I'm pretty sure it was Friday that I put this corn in. So it lasted a week and a, week and a day. Pretty good. Um, I spilled some corn right in here. 
gonna pick up the bifurcs here in a little bit. But um, I'm gonna move over here. Cause right here is the front of the mall tree. I wanna spread some corn right there. So uh, hang on just for a minute, please. Okay, so the corn's out on the ground, as you can see. It's in front of the Moultrie game camera, which is right there on that tree. I want to go ahead and uh, hang this uh, corn feeder back up. Put the lid back on it and uh, hang it back up until uh, I get some more corn. So we got corn spread right there, we got corn spread right there, and uh, we still got salt in that area right there. So we are we are fine, we are, we're good to go for right now until um, I gotta work tomorrow at five. I get my paycheck Monday um, at two, but then I had to work three hours later. So um, Wednesday, Wednesday I'll probably be back out here, putting corn in it, and um, Gosh, it is, it is June, I don't even know what day it is, day, day it is, hang on, June 21st, that's actually what I was going to guess, June 21st, it's June 21st right now, and um, I've got a lot of crap to do before bowl season, um, but I want to continue with the, uh, with the corn for right now. Um, to get it um, good, get the beer used to it, um, get them used to coming down here, um, figure out uh, figure out the times that uh, the big bucks and stuff are going to come down here, and uh, just uh, just do some research on these bucks and these deer and uh, turkeys for uh, fall turkey season, um, because I I will be up in that tree stand the opening morning of bow season. That's a guarantee, and I'm not lying. Um, plus I got some, um, my birthday's coming up in a month and three days from now. So, um, I got some things that I want to get for my birthday before, um, bow season comes to make, uh, the hunt a lot more special for you guys to get, uh, um, to get some action. I mean, because, um, I know that you guys are getting tired of, uh, tired of seeing me talk all the time. So, um, definitely going to get some new stuff for, um, for, video and bow hunts but uh let's check it let's check the memory card right quick first let me get the uh get the uh, new memory card out of my wallet i lost my um well i didn't lose it i put i had to um go to work on father's day and so i was down there at my mom and papa's house so i just took everything with me and um like I, I i was going to check the memory card father's day but i decided not to and waited for today and um so i threw my memory card in my mom's purse and my mom's in Louisville right now she won't be back until tomorrow so uh i had to um i had to get the old uh the other black memory card and put it in here which ain't no big deal. I mean, boom. Put the put the memory card that I just took out of uh, the camera in my left hand. I have my new uh, memory card in my right hand. All right, uh, turn this baby on. All right, ten seconds before it starts taking pictures. I love the mall trees. I want to buy me some more. Love them. Absolutely love them. But I want to go back. 
corn is out. Deer's digging. Let's go back and uh, hopefully we'll see some action on the uh, on the memory card that we just took out of the Moultrie game camera. See y'all at home. Bye.